So I think people who say, you know, we're going to do a generic hydrometallurgy train or all hydro trains are similar, that's a bit, you know, shallow of a statement. It's really about designing this as an integrated network and having it work with that strategy to balance the operating costs with your recovery efficiencies and, and not just going for the high value components. And you, you mentioned lithium specifically. I mean, lithium is challenging to recover in a recycling system because it's designed to be the mobile ion within a battery. So it's literally in, in every component. So when you start disassembling and sorting, you can segregate different elements relatively easily, but lithium itself is really in, in all of those components. So it's not just be able to recover some of it, not just the aqueous lithium, not just what was dissolved in the non-aqueous solvent, what was embedded in the active anode and the cathode, and really getting to a process where you can recover not just the primary streams, but the side streams, the recovery streams, those are really how you get to the much higher recovery rates for all of these ions of value.